Panir Muxam is a beautiful village located in the Alapaza district of Kerala, India. The village is a perfect place to escape from the hustle and bustle of city life, enjoying the beautiful paddy fields, backwaters, and village views. The watershed is located very close to Kumarakam and is easily accessible from Kachi and Alapaza. Thanir Muxam is an important place on the backwater tourism map. There are several resorts in the area. It's a very nice village situated near to Bembanadu Kyle, and northwest side of Kutanadu. It's enriched with temples, churches, schools, hospitals, stadium, public library and other art and sports cultural clubs etc. Near Mukham Bund connecting to Kota M and Alapaza district. The starting point of is in Thanir Mukham. The Thanir Mukham Bund, considered the largest mud regulator in the country, was built as part of the Kutanad development scheme. This barrier has helped the farmers in Kutanad, where farming is done below sea level. The huge construction is built across Lake Bembanad, the largest lake of the state, and divides the lake into two parts. One with brackish water perennially and the other half with fresh water fed by the rivers draining into the lake. It also connects the two districts of Kote Am and Alapaza through the Thanir Muxam and Bekur villages on either side of the Bund.
Alapaza district is one of the 14 districts in the state of Kerala in India. Alapaza is the smallest district in Kerala. The district is best known for its picturesque backwaters, by which it is well connected to other parts of Kerala, including the tourist destination of Kumarakam, the district being a well-known tourist destination. The district is also known for its coir factories, as most of Kerala's coir industries are situated in and around Alapaza town. The district is home to the communist-led Punna Pravilar uprising against the Diwan. Kutanad, the rice bowl of Kerala, was well known from early in the Sangam period. History says Alapaza had trade relations with ancient Greece and Rome in BC and in the Middle Ages. There is archaeological evidence of the early period of the district, such as stone inscriptions and monuments. In the 17th century the Portuguese power declined and the Dutch had a predominant position in the principalities of this district. It was at that time that the great and talented poet Kunjan Nambiar was installed in the court. He was known as the maker of modern Aleppi and played a key role in making Alapaza a premier port town of Travancore. The first modern factory for the manufacture of coir mats and mattings was also established in 1859 at Alapaza. This district had a prominent role in the freedom struggle of the country. The first political strike in Kerala was held at Alapaza in 1938. Alapaza is known as the Venice of the East. Offering the best tourist places in Aleppi, this charming place is the hub of Kerala's backwaters and is home to a huge network of backwaters and more than thousand houseboats. Alapaza Beach is a famous picnic spot and so it's a favorite gateway for locals. Amusement amenities at the Vijaya Beach Park add charm to the beach. It houses the popular ancient pier that is approximate. Uninterrupted view of life in the backwaters fringed with coconut trees can be enjoyed from a houseboat. A perfect place to unwind with its laid-back canals and lush greenery. 
The Alapazaw beach with a 137-year-old pier extending into the sea and an old 17th-century lighthouse built by the Portuguese add to the magic of the place. It is famous for its boat races, marine products, and coir industry. Float along and gaze over paddy fields of succulent green, curvaceous rice barges and village life along the banks. Indeed, it is here that nature has spent upon the land her richest bounties. Come and explore the best tourist places in Aleppi, 